How long do you think it takes for a solar power recharge station for electric cars to pay off? Find out how environmental economics is working here. What we've got here, is, as you can see over our head, which is actually reducing our heat load on our parking lot, is a solar array. We have them here and then on the roof of the building. Basically, these solar array provides most of the power for our building all the time. So we're, we're actually, on most days, generating a little more power than we actually use. So we send the rest back out to the grid. And that includes being able to recharge uh, vehicles. So we have, uh, I believe, four, five different recharge points here. Uh, for company cars and for employee cars. So like this Volt is plugged in uh, and it's getting power off the solar array. So this basically, what's very cool is this is a zero carbon car now. Uh, this vehicle has no greenhouse gas uh, uh, emissions at all when it drives off the solar power array. So, you know, the electrical grid in California is pretty clean, but when you go off solar, as we know we are right here in our own building, uh, this vehicle is putting out no emissions, so it's a zero carbon commute. We got into it partly because we were just looking at how, how do we walk our talk, how do we start reducing you know, our impact, because uh, that's what CalStart is all about. And, and solar has really gotten to such an attractive point that there were lease options out there, together with some assistance we got from the city of Pasadena and some other incentives, it made a business case for us. We'll be able to pay this investment off in 10 years.